France is on the brink of reintroducing a land-based ballistic missile capability, with plans for a new missile system that could have a range exceeding 1,000 kilometers. This would be the first such initiative since 1997, when the country decommissioned its last land-based missile, the Hades. The proposal reflects the growing global reliance on ballistic missile systems, which have shown significant effectiveness in recent conflicts. The missile's development aims to enhance France's strategic options, filling a key gap in its defense capabilities, as the nation's existing missile systems are all submarine-based and primarily focused on nuclear deterrence. Currently, France lacks a land-based ballistic missile option. Its sole ballistic missile, the M51, is launched from submarines and serves a nuclear deterrent role. However, recent discussions between the French Armed Forces and the Directorate General of Armaments, DGA, have centered on developing a land-based missile capable of being deployed from mobile platforms such as trucks. Early conceptual designs suggest that the missile may incorporate terminal phase maneuverability, a feature that would make it more difficult for enemy defense systems to intercept. The effectiveness of such missiles has been demonstrated in recent conflicts, where advanced missile defense systems have struggled to intercept long-range ballistic threats. For example, Ukraine's interception rate of Russia's Iskander M missiles is a mere 4.3%, and Iran's missile strikes against Israel expose the limitations of systems like Iron Dome and David Sling in handling large-scale missile attacks. France has a long history of developing ground-launched ballistic missiles. Post-World War II, France embarked on several missile projects, with the first significant development being the Super V2, a project pursued between 1946 and 1947. This intermediate-range missile, although never operational, was capable of ranges up to 3,600 kilometers. The S-2 missile, introduced in 1971, was a solid-propellant intermediate-range missile with a powerful thermonuclear warhead, followed by the S-3 in 1980, which remained in service until 1996. The Pluton missile, introduced in 1974, was a short-range tactical missile with a nuclear or conventional warhead, succeeded by the Hades missile in 1991 which had a range of about 480 kilometers. The Hades missile was decommissioned by 1997, leaving France without a land-based ballistic missile option for nearly three decades. The new land-based missile program would not replace France's existing long-range land strike, FLPT initiative, which focuses on rocket artillery systems with a range up to 150 kilometers. Rather, the proposed ballistic missile would provide additional strategic options, particularly for deep strikes in conflicts. With a range over 1,000 kilometers, this missile would allow France to target adversaries at significant distances, offering a complementary capability to its existing arsenal of Rafale jets and cruise missiles. The missile's development could also tie into the European Long Range Strike Approach, ELSA, a collaborative effort involving several European nations, including Germany, Italy, Poland, the United Kingdom, and Sweden. The success of this missile would enhance France's ability to conduct strategic strikes further reinforcing its military capabilities in a rapidly changing geopolitical landscape. Ballistic missiles are an integral part of modern military arsenals due to their ability to deliver warheads over long distances with great speed and precision. Their high altitude and speed make interception difficult, and their ballistic trajectory allows them to reach a wide range of targets. Some ballistic missiles are equipped with multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicles, MIRVs, enabling a single missile to strike multiple targets. These characteristics give ballistic missiles a significant strategic advantage in both deterrence and offensive operations. Recent conflicts have highlighted the growing reliance on ballistic missiles. For instance, in October 2024, Iran launched 180 ballistic missiles at Israel, with several penetrating Israel's advanced missile defense systems and causing damage to key military targets. Russia has employed a variety of ballistic missiles, including the Iskander and Kinzhal, since the start of its invasion of Ukraine. These missiles, along with newer systems like the Orshnik and Iskander 1000, reflect the growing capabilities of adversaries using ballistic missile systems. Other nations, such as China, North Korea, and South Korea, have also heavily invested in ballistic missile technology, with systems capable of striking targets over long distances and penetrating advanced defenses. The proliferation of ballistic missile technology is a clear indication of the increasing strategic importance of these weapons in modern defense strategies. While the development of a new land-based ballistic missile system represents a significant leap in France's defense capabilities, it faces considerable challenges. Funding remains a critical issue, as France's military budget is already stretched with ongoing projects, 
including the upgrade of the M-51 missile system and the development of the ASN-4G air-launched nuclear missile. The success of this new missile system will depend on the balance of resources allocated to it alongside other high-priority military initiatives. Nevertheless, the proposed missile could strengthen France's position in global defense dynamics, complementing its existing capabilities while adding a new layer of flexibility and reach to its strategic options. As geopolitical tensions continue to rise, the importance of land-based, long-range missile systems will only grow, underscoring the need for modern military forces to maintain robust and diverse deterrent and strike capabilities. France's exploration of a new land-based ballistic missile system marks a critical step in its efforts to modernize its defense capabilities. With its potential to strike targets at distances greater than 1,000 kilometers, the missile would enhance France's strategic options in a rapidly evolving global security environment. As ballistic missile technology continues to play a vital role in contemporary military operations, this development aligns France with a growing trend of nations investing in long-range strike capabilities, ensuring its continued relevance in the global defense landscape.